Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Dan from DHTV and today I'm going to be showing you how you can remove the automatic download of the U2 album when you update it to iOS 8. Let's get started. Okay, so to kick things off, let's go ahead and open up the music app here and you can see I have the U2 album open and you can see some of them have this little cloud and that's because I've deleted some songs. Now, a simple way to delete the song if you would just like to delete specific songs is just to slide to the left on the song you'd like to delete and you can delete it and then that way if you want to get it back you can because this method that I'm about to show you that deletes the whole album doesn't allow you to actually get this back for free. So if you want this again in the future, you may have to pay for it. So what we need to do is go into Safari and you want to go to this website. Now I've placed the link in the description down below because it's a really long link and it'll take you to this page here which basically allows you to remove the U2 album. So we'll go ahead and tap on remove album down here. It'll pop up and it'll say sign in to remove album from your account. So you need to put in your Apple ID and password. So once you've signed in, you'll get this notification. It'll say Songs of Innocence has been removed from your account. And you can read this small print here. It says your devices and computers should automatically update to reflect. Now, if you do this on your computer or your iPad or anything like that, it should remove it from all your devices. So we'll go ahead and open up the music app here. And you can see no content because I don't have anything else in my music app. Now, if you still see it there, you can easily swipe to the left on the album and it'll go ahead and delete it. But basically, all you would have to do if you do see the album Album still there is just sign out of your iTunes account on your computer and sign back in and then you'll automatically have the album deleted. Anyway guys I hope you found this video helpful if you did help support my channel by sharing the video on your favorite social media sites it helps support my channel and keep these videos going and free. Also if you guys want to subscribe it'll let you know when I post a new video all about tech tips tricks tutorials on the iPhone iPad and iPod touch as well as other tech devices and if you enjoyed the video hit the like button and if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment in the comment box down below. I respond to every comment that comes my way. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.